Carrying concealed should be comfortable. People carry concealed different ways. Bodies are shaped differently. You know, what works for me doesn't work for you. It doesn't work for my wife. My wife likes to carry in her purse or on her body. I can't carry appendix in my vehicle because my gut gets in the way. Carrying behind me in a vehicle, my back gets in the way, it's uncomfortable against the seat. So trying to find something that's comfortable for you. I recommend before you go out and purchase a holster, go to a local firearm shop, try the holsters they have, see what works for you so you can carry comfortably. At the end of the day, everyday carry is important, but it needs to be comfortable and your firearm needs to operate properly when you're using it. Your firearm is like a tool, kind of like your automobile. There's regular maintenance that needs to be done. Changing the, the tires, checking your tire pressures, changing your oil. Um, a firearm is no different. The steps and procedures that I showed you today should give you the confidence that you can take care of your firearm. So at the end of the day, the firearm can take care of you if you